parts of the state's southeast are cleaning up again tonight after another hailstorm damaged homes and businesses between Brisbane and the Gold Coast. Wind gusts of up to 140 kilometres an hour were recorded. Reporter Josh Bavis has more. Well, the series of storm cells began moving in at about 2 o'clock. That stretched from about Tweed Heads right up to the Wide Bay. Now, one of the more serious cells moved across the Gold Coast here at Coomera. A man and his teenage daughter were taken to hospital after a large tree crashed on their car. Residents in this area of Coomera say the storm came over black and fierce. You couldn't see anything. It was completely black. And lightning was just came, coming straight down. And it was thunder really, really loud. Oh, it was pretty intense. It's probably the worst storm we've seen. We've been here for uh, probably two years now. Had a lot of storms, but uh, yeah, you know, trees are ripped off, uh, well, leaves are ripped off trees, and they're pretty intense. Well, at the height of the storm, about 9,000 homes and businesses lost power across the southeast. Energex crews will try and restore that throughout the rest of the evening. Now, forecasters say this was likely to have been the last of the severe thunderstorms to move across the southeast this week. They're expecting clearer conditions in the coming days.